Greetings in Jesus' mighty name. We welcome you to a wonderful series called Journey to the Cross by New Hope TV. Beloved brothers and sisters, this is a time where the Lord is revealing to us His plans and His ordinances for us to align ourselves to Him. I want you to open to Matthew chapter 16 verses 24. Here the word of God says, Jesus said then to his disciples, If anyone desires to come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross and follow me. There are three things we see over here as we look to the cross and look to the author and the finisher of our faith. The Lord expects us to, number one, deny ourselves, deny you know, all the self-centeredness within us, all that concerns us and come to a position of selflessness, absolute selflessness, which was exactly the character of Christ. And then the Lord expects us to take up the cross and follow him. Jesus picked up a cross that was burdensome. But do you know what that cross was? That cross was yours and my burden. As we are following Jesus, he expects us to live up to his example. And when he says, you take your cross, if his cross was our burden, let, then he means our cross should be someone else's burden. Hallelujah. If you are willing to take up the cross, take up the burden of people who yet not know the Lord, and then the Lord expects you in this way, you keep following him. I am telling you, you are on the way of pleasing the Lord and, and reaching the destination of glory. May the Lord bless you and help you. Let us pray this moment that we will live a life selfless, live a life with burden of souls and live a life, you know, following Christ. No turning back, no turning back. Jesus, we pray and we ask you that you would give us the grace, O oh God, to deny ourselves. Give us the strength to come above every selfishness within us and look up, O oh God, to the ministry of selflessness, ministry of carrying the burden of others and thus following you because this is pleasing and rightful in your eyes. Bless each one of us, strengthen us that we may do your will. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, amen and amen.